What's up, Arizona? Good evening. Welcome back out here to Flagstaff. This is it from us for Turkey Tuesday. Yes. Just want to say thank you again for making this such day, this day such a success right here on 12 News. We are in Flagstaff. We've been here all afternoon. San Francisco dances, Catholic church and school. It's been a lot of fun. Rachel, we a record number of turkeys that were brought to up here at Flagstaff. We most certainly Which did. is cool. We are in the kitchen. We've been told not to touch anything. <laughs> we cannot cook politely. anything. Yeah. Please but don't touch us. Please anything. don't touch us. Bang. But that's cool because we got some cool, but, cool yeah, stuff. But yeah, but then to show they set like 12 packs of beer in front of the Sun Devil. <laughs> so uh, now we're going to be doing some hands on demonstrations. We're not rushing the field we're again, Rachel. We're not rushing the field okay? today, but boy, am I a proud Sun Devil up here in NAU country. We have Chef Laura, and you are showing us how to pair some of the best parts of Thanksgiving, if you ask me, the charcuterie board with, of course, some beverages. So talk to us a little bit about the pairings and what we should be doing. Yeah, so we have three cheeses available, which most charcuterie boards I think is great to have a, a selection, a variety, exactly. So we have Manchego, which is a Spanish sheep's milk Ooh. cheese, and that is gonna go best with a strong IPA. Uh -oh. So, Conveniently, yep. we have a place right here. <laughs> yeah. Game show. It is. All right. Behind beer number Let's, one. Yeah, right? I love it. And then what other, what are we working so with in the middle? A smoked Gouda, which is cow's milk cheese. And that's going to go really nice with the railhead red. Okay. Oh, yes. From the right. yard. There we go. Yard representing. Okay. And then last but not least, this is a nice soft cheese. Yeah. So that's a goat cheese, uh, fresh. It's Chev. And uh, that is going to go very nicely with the Tower Station uh, citrus, blood orange. Um, it would also go really nice with the other Lumberyard IPAs. It's hard to go wrong yeah. with the pairings, but those are some <laughs> of the better ones. Rachel, you cannot I, take these home. Uh, yes, I know, right? They're like, please, please take that out of your satchel. Um, obviously, we have Lumberyard and Mother Road um, represented here. And Dylan, I mean, what is so special about these breweries, not to mention how close they are in proximity here in the city of Flagstaff? Well, First off, we have our tower station right here, our, our go-to IPA, our, our flagship that everyone knows about. Um, and I was very excited to be with Kelly and Lumberyard because we're literally a stone's throw about a block away. Um, and we pair very well together, as Chef Laura said. <laughs> um, but what we got here is our blood orange IPA, the Roadside Grove. Um, a little more of that citrusy, pretty color in it. A little bit more bitter than you get with the regular tower station. And then we also have our turbo tower station, there we go. which is an imperial IPA uh, brew with mango. So this would be a nice, sweet. You, when you drink this beer, you don't think it tastes 9%. And then it's a good time to be spending the night wherever you are for Thanksgiving <laughs> to have. And and yes, drink responsibly, how please. Close and last but not least. Last thing here in Flagstaff, yes. Kelly, we've got about 30 seconds left. 30 seconds. What do you want to tell all the people out there? Well, first off, beer goes with Thanksgiving. So my recommendation, always do the real head red. It goes with any of your Thanksgiving food. Yes. And we also are going to donate $500 for Turkey Tuesday there just to go. cap it off here in Flagstaff <laughs> and finish strong. Kelly, thank you so much. Also, you're joined by your friends back here. Yes, yes, there we go. We're getting everybody on TV up here in Flagstaff. Guys, thank you so much for coming. Rachel, it's been a fantastic day. It has. I'm glad that you were up here. This yeah. is my second time up here. It's been so spectacular. We just, we appreciate all all the partnerships, obviously, St. Yeah. Vincent de Paul, Discover Flagstaff always welcomes us with open arms, and we love all the vendors that they have in tow, along with Desert Financial, of course, and yeah. we had Satchmos here showcasing everything everything, yeah, everything. good about, about Turkey Tuesday. <laughs> so we appreciate everyone's generosity, and we look forward to next year.